Hi there, so today we are looking at what do you use to mold your fascinator? Which is the best? Is it stiffener or is it top bond? Which do you use? Do let me know in the comment section below. Which do you use to mold your hats and your fascinator? For me, I make use of both the stiffener and the top bond. I know most people outside Nigeria, I think it's not the stiffener that you have in your country i think they have names but as the stiffener is the one that comes in this type of containers white containers and is white in it and then we have the top bond which is usually made for building construction but we also make use of it to mold fascinators now for me i prefer to use the stiffener when i'm molding um, hats or fascinators with straw paper mats and um, cinnamon or any other material aside when i'm using the padded or the um, warden padded warden interfacing there are different names that people call them but where i am the town that i'm in is called padded why i use it instead of the top bond is that top bond sometimes you can't really um melt it so well that it won't leave stains on your um on the type of um, materials i just mentioned now but i make use of the top bond when i'm using padded and warding and that's because it's cheaper to me because padded and warding i so you have to soak the material and the thickest material for molding so far that i've seen is your padded and um, or warding or interfacing because it's almost like foam it's like very thick foam so it sucks a lot so you will need a lot of it when molding as compared to the other types of material so that's why i make use of um the top one there and then if you're not able to melt it very well the um, padded is going to be covered finally with another material so the stains will not be visible so i just decided to drop this i hope it helped someone out today and if it did help you please do give me a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to this channel such tips are what i bring to you and also diys of various crafts so please do click the subscribe button and also the bell so you get notified when i upload new videos and check out this next tip